Hey guys, it's me, Christina Marie. Today we are talking about anti-aging products. Yes, we are. We are talking about a sleeping cream and a serum that are supposedly going to get rid of my wrinkles, my age spots, going to make my skin look like I'm 20 all over again. This is actually sold out on Sephora's website, which I was really shocked. So I'm like, it got, I think like four or five stars. So I'm like, I had to try it. So I have been trying this for three weeks. Do I see a difference in the photos? You guys are going to have to wait till the end to get my final opinion. But I'm going to tell you, I documented using this for the last three weeks, right? So I took super, super close up TMI. Don't get me wrong. If you guys don't want to see large pores or facial hair, which after I looked at the photo, I was like, oh my God, I need to do my mustache. <laughs> then don't look at the photos. Just go to the end. <laughs> but I took pictures the last three weeks comparing like photo to photo, um, seeing was there a difference or not? Because you guys know I'm going to keep it real. It, there is no difference. And this is just a, a very expensive product. I'm going to be like, I'm going to tell you the truth. You know, we keep it real on this channel. Here is by Olay Henriksen. Transform, Transform Plus fights all major signs of aging. That's what it says. Glow Cycle. Retinin ALT Power Serum. Targets fine lines and wrinkles. Age Fighting Facial Serum. I have not skipped one day of wearing these, by the way. And then over here, we have the Olay Henriksen Good Night Glow Retinin ALT sleeping cream targets fine lines and wrinkles. Transform Plus fights all major signs of aging. Okay, but I have spent quite a bit of money on aging products in the past and they didn't work. And I let you guys know that save your money. Does this work? We're going to go ahead and jump on over to those photos close in the very first photos I took on the 13th, I believe are super close to my face, guys. You will see the wrinkles in my chin. You will see the wrinkles on my lip. You will see my age spots. You will see all the nitty gritty that I normally cover up with makeup. Um, but did it make my skin look younger? You guys let me know what you think after you see these pictures and check out the full review. But before we get there, please hit that thumbs up button. Let's go ahead and just jump on over to that video. morning so today is the last day i'll be using this product i think i've been using it for almost uh almost three weeks or three weeks something like that anyways um so i'm also going to be taking pictures today and comparing the close-ups of original close-up pictures that i took with today's pictures you guys saw when i zoom really close into my face it's kind of embarrassing but you know i know you guys appreciate seeing the real truth on my chin is where i get all these little lines especially when my my skin is dry and i want you guys to know that Every picture that I've been taking is when my skin is completely dry. So I'm not trying to fool you guys having a moisturizer on my face or anything like that. Every single picture, I have nothing on my skin because I want to see what my skin looks like without any moisture uh, moisturizers to see if it's made a difference or not. You guys caught, saw, especially like right here, the little fine lines in my lips, the lines in my chin, the discoloration. So we're going to be zooming in and I'm going to be comparing the ones that I took originally and then the ones that I took right now. But I want to show you guys what this looks like. So it... You can see it's purple and it has the most lovely smell. It smells like it's a, a vanilla lemon, uh, almost uh, like the mm, Bath and Body Works. Back in the day, they had that vanilla, vanilla something lotion. I don't know why I'm having a brain freeze, but you guys can see it smells amazing. Now, what does it do when I put it on the skin? Let's show you. Does it have like this iridescent glow? I don't know, let's see. So this is typically how much I've been using. Do you see a difference? I think it kind of gives your skin just like this, like reflectant off of it. So any makeup or anything that you put on your skin is going to look lovely. So I'm not sure if you can tell, but you see how it gives your skin like this glow. It's not a huge difference, but it's enough to see it. You kind of see when I have a lot of my hand house drying down, it has that like reflectant 
almost kind of like what sunscreen does a little bit. And I will say that when you put it on, it dries down pretty darn quick, which is great. I always put my um, serums or moisturizers on my eyes as well. But there you go. So you kind of see it better there. So when you put a, um, your makeup on top of this, it's going to kind of make your skin look a little bit more flawless. Now, when it comes to the Nighttime Glow Sleeping Cream, let me show you. So same exact fragrance, right? Rub it on the skin. But this one doesn't really have that like reflectant like the serum does. I don't know if you guys can tell the difference. Like it doesn't really, and you can see that it hydrates and it stays very slippery, which is lovely, especially like if you're, you know, obviously sleeping, it's a sleeping cream, um, but it doesn't have this type of reflectant. I'm going to go ahead and do my makeup and I'm going to show you guys what my skin looks like once I've done it. And you can tell, I think I could tell, um, the difference of, I mean, it's kind of like when you put a primer that has a, uh, not a shimmer that has a sheen, sheen to it. Um, that has like a shot. Oh, let me just grab the product and show you. Okay. So this is by iconic London. It's an illuminator. That's what it's called. I don't know. My brain is just, it's fried this morning. It, it hasn't had its coffee. So an illuminator, I'm just going to pour, put a pour. <sighs> Hopefully you guys stay with me because I'm trying to get my words out and they're not coming out this morning. Okay. So an illuminator, you guys can see it has like a reflectant. That's what I was talking about. Right? So when you put an illuminator under your foundation, it kind of just gives your skin this base to be like, to have that extra glow, to have just that, like that perfection. Um, that's what an illuminator does. And that's kind of similar to what this is doing on my face. You can see just the shine throughout the whole thing. Now, if I wanted to walk outside with no makeup, I could, it's, I would just look like I'm a little bit, um, greasy, I guess you could say. Um, but it's not like a super huge, huge difference. It's not like a super illuminator like this, but it does a different, it does enough to make me look like I have shine to my skin. But I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup. I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay guys, so I thought I would turn on the camera real quick so you guys can see. I think you can tell in this lighting a lot better, like how the skin, how it has that luminosity to it. It's not overwhelming. It just kind of looks like I have a little bit of oil on my face, but you can see how the light kind of reflects off because I have my studio lights behind the camera, but you can see that. Let's do in comparison to my neck. So you see my neck, we didn't take it down to the neck or the chest or anything like that. And then as I turn, you can see how it shines off my nose, off my cheekbone. Like, that's what I was talking about. It has that luminosity to it. So it's going to make your makeup look a little bit better. I'm going to go ahead and come back once I do my eye makeup. And I'm, we're gonna, you're gonna, I'm going to show you what my foundation looks like when I put it on. Sorry if I'm tripping on my words today. I don't know why I'm like, you know, just one of those days where you're stumbling over your words. But that is what I was talking about. If you can tell, let me know in the comment section if you can tell what I'm talking about. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so you saw me put on my foundation. You see how, like, my skin, how it, I don't, it makes it look, um, I don't know, more even, I guess you could say, when you have something like an illuminator under your foundation. You don't, just look at it. It looks great, doesn't it? Especially, look at under the eyes. You see how I have this shine under the eyes? That is from the serum. Look at that. Now, obviously, we're going to take a powder and put it on top of this to kind of mattify it a little bit. But once I spray my setting spray, which I'm going to do, uh, you'll see how it, it melts into it. And like the skin looks more even. It looks like it has just a hint more of a youthfulness when you have like a reflectant like that under your under your makeup. <laughs> Okay.
Okay, guys. So what did you think? I on it. Oh, you guys know I keep it real. And yeah, like I was mortified when I saw some of those photos up close because I was like, oh, oh my gosh. You know, of course, I got my mirror and started tweezing everything. But <laughs> let's get to the point. Let's get to the point. Honestly, I did see a difference. Did you see a difference? I want you guys to know that every single photo that I took, I had absolutely no serum, no moisturizers on my face. So I'm not going to be like trying to fool you guys and be like, oh, yeah, look at the big difference. Uh, because a lot of people will do that, you know. They'll do a video and they'll be like, oh, yeah, it took all my wrinkles away. But prior, like the first photos had um, nothing on your skin and then the second photo had moisturizer. That's tricking. That's fooling you guys. I'm keeping it real. Every single photo had no moisturizer, no nothing on my skin. And I did see a difference. Did you? Let me know. I mean, I obviously saw the difference. Look, I mean, I know I'm wearing makeup. I know that. But you don't see. Look. You don't see the lines like they were. And then uh, you can't really tell when I have makeup on. Um, but I did see a difference. I would say that this is a good cream. I saw a difference after only this many days. So you guys know me. I'm not going to be, you know, some products say, oh, you have to use it for four months to see a difference. I'm not going to spend my money on something that doesn't work like that because I want results. I want to look good now, not like six, four or six months later. So I would recommend this. If I can find a link to it, I will post it down below. Like I had mentioned, I think uh, Sephora was sold out. If I can find a link through Amazon, I'll post it down below. Um, but I give I give this product a thumbs up. What did you think? It has a, it has a beautiful like uh, fragrance to it. It's a beautiful. It reminds me of an old Ralph Lauren uh, perfume or a um, Bath and Body Works lotion. It has that hint of like lemon and um I don't know vanilla or or it's just it's a beautiful old school fragrance that I I enjoy. I mean, I know that you know not everybody wants those extra things in their serums, you know, all those extra fragrances, but I, it makes me enjoy the product even more. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video while you're watching it. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Hit that little subscribe button and the tiny little bell next to it for notifications of new videos. You know, share my videos. I appreciate everybody watching and supporting my channel. I love all of you. Thank you so, so much. Let's go ahead and just roll on over to the quote of the day. I'm Christina Marie. I'm out. Bye.